Well, excitement in the air. We've all known about this date for a long time, and the stage is set in the Spanish capital for the UEFA Champions League final. Hello, everyone. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary, as always, on these big occasions by Lee Dixon. And we're approaching kickoff time here at the Estadio Metropolitano. It's Milan taking on Liverpool. Well, it's an absolute pleasure, Derek, to be here. Very, very lucky indeed to be broadcasting to millions and millions of people, let alone watching this fantastic game. I'm sure the players are a little bit nervous as well with that audience looming in the background, tuning in on their televisions. It's going to be a great night. I'm very excited to be here. Hopefully we get the game that this tournament deserves. in the old days of this competition no English team prospered more than Liverpool well one of the best teams in this competition of all times and who will forget that final against Milan can they repeat that tonight here's the Milan team it looks like a conventional 4-4-2 preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. is it given away by the Rossoneri not much defensive cover there on the flank that's how to flummox the opposing defender Roberto Firmino the Brazilian at the ready and heading it just over the bar yeah he thinks he's in he thinks he's scored and it's just over the bar It's with Romagnoli. It's with Gonzalo Higuain. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Not well, is he going to give them the advantage? Well, you have to say, he's going to be very cross with himself. Well, how's he missed it? It should be the first goal of the game. Joe Gomez, Alexander Arnold, Wijnaldo now, here's Milner, Mane, and space on the wing for Liverpool. And going through Mane, is it going to be Firmino? A goal it is, the first important statement in this final made by Liverpool. Well, we've got the biggest club competition in the world, and now we've got our first goal. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Joe Gomez. Alexander Arnold. He hears the footsteps and feels the pressure.
Kessier. And dispossessed. Intelligent threaded pass here. That is goalkeeping of the highest order and of the bravest order as well. Well, it's not all about tipping balls over the bar and round the post. It's about being brave and diving at players' feet. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? A really sumptuous ball. It's a weighted pass. Fine reaction save from the goalkeeper. Goalkeeping at its best. Really, really top draw. Goals win games. He's been a joy to watch. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? He cuts it back. By Naldum now. Now Mo Salah. It's with Roberto Firmino. And Mohamed Salah now. Can he make this move count? It's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. And options in the centre. Wijnaldum. Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. <laughs> Milner delivering here. Thumps clear. The corner kicks keep on coming. Routine save for the keeper. Yes, yeah, the distance. Look how far out he is. Easy, easy save in the end. Tiamue Bakayoko. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. It's with Roberto Firmino. A matter of keeping his composure. And the goal gaping at him. Oh, he's missed the chance to extend their advantage. Oh, a golden opportunity to really put the game to bed. This is in front in the second half. What will be the thinking in the camp, Lee Dixon? All the Liverpool players will be looking up at the clock. Time is ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue those missed chances? They could be costly. And this time, it's in! Wow, what technique. When the ball comes to you and you don't need a touch and you can just whack it first time like this. What a goal. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Cleared away. It's with Fabinho. Sadio Mane now. Fabinho. An incisive pass. And a goal! The keeper will be frustrated. He thought he'd saved it. He's so unlucky there. It's a good angle from him as well, but it's in the back of the net. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle.
well, some might say back to where they belong. An absolutely brilliant night, capped off with winning the trophy. Commiserations for their opposition, but at the moment it's all about celebration for those boys. Yeah, that is precisely what they intend to do, Lee. Celebrate long into the evening. Liverpool the victors. Well, now, as a player, and in this case, as a Liverpool player, you've got to prepare yourself for the trophy lift. Well, yeah, this is where you want to be the captain. Sometimes it's a hindrance because everybody's looking at you for a bit of inspiration. But you get to do this. You get to pick up this magnificent trophy and celebrate with your teammates. Liverpool this year have painted Europe red. It's official now. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, certainly the red half of Liverpool and Merseyside will be celebrating tonight. Not so sure about the Everton fans, but even they might celebrate a little bit. Well, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. Ticket tapes coming down, the families in the stand, giving them all away. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019.